How's it going guys? This is the second video for the League of Rockets $1,000 tournament. This is the second round match. Um, it was me versus Pashi90. If you guys didn't catch it live, well, now's your chance to watch it. Uh, the event will be in the description. If you guys didn't see that yet, definitely go check it out because it was very well done. But nonetheless, let's get into the gameplay. So Pashi, I'm sure a lot of you know him. He's a really good ones player. Hasn't been playing as much ones. Neither have I. I've been playing a lot of threes, trying to focus on that. But he's a very good ones player and definitely one to be scared of. Um, when it comes to this game in particular, we played it on EU servers. And on EU, I get like 140 to 160 ping, which is really bad. And it makes it hard for me to react to a lot of things. So if you see me do something a little bit sketchy, that's most likely why. Because I couldn't really see where the ball is going. You can't see it in the replay. But I get really bad lag on EU. So I was unfortunately the only player in the entire tournament to have to play on a cross-region server. Anyway, let's get into the game now. So, we have a pretty neutral kickoff here. Just waiting to see what he does. I didn't have much boost, so I'm just going to head back. This is pretty bad of me. I probably could have intercepted that. And if I had just went for the ball and hit it back to my corner, they probably would have gave me enough time to get boost and then keep ball control from there and take it up the field and so on. It is okay, though, because we do get a kickoff back. I was so surprised that I was actually winning kickoffs on this, like, horrible ping that I, I I would never think I'd win kickoffs especially against a good kickoff taker the fact that I was winning kickoffs on like really bad ping was like really good to see because I knew I had a chance you know that was two kickoffs in a row kind of helped me out gave me a, a cheeky lead early on again another win but he does get back to it and plays it out pretty decently I could have probably capitalized on that if I knew he was doing a little bit better Alright, really bad 50-50 for me. As soon as I knew I lost that, like I messed up the dribble, I should have just went straight back or tried to hit it to a corner or something. But the second I went on like a bad piece of the ball, it just gave him a free 50-50 and a clear. And it led to that goal, pretty much. I made a bad hit to the side and I couldn't recover him in the boost. Alright, a really, really bad kickoff again. I was able to recover though and get a decent amount of boost to get to it. Remember if you don't have boost, picking up one or two pads is more than enough to jump up for a save. I would normally save that, I want to say, but probably looked a lot different at the time. I don't exactly remember. Good shot from him nonetheless though. Alright, was able to get back using the pads. Pretty good job for me. Pashi does well here to make me back off. I have no boost. He recognizes that, so he goes for a shot, and I just can't get a save on it. Really well done from Pashi. You catch me out like that with no boost. Good kickoff win again. Really good. That, that works. That works. I mean, I shouldn't be this close right now. I should be down like 5-1, but... The beauty of kickoffs. I did it again. I made two saves where he was about to get a kickoff goal and I saved it like right on the line. This game could have been so different. Like it should have been like 7-1 right now. Jeez. And that's pretty good for me. So I, I went for the ball. I flipped into the ball and I ended up catching a bit of his car. I got kind of lucky and it spun him out and it just led to a nice little free net for me. Pretty neutral kickoff. Fake that patch a little bit. I know he's going to go for a boost here, so I just try to take a shot on goal. He doesn't make the best hit, but I don't know what that was for me. I, I kind of just uh, messed it up a little bit. I could have probably shot it, but, you know, everyone makes mistakes. Good pre-jump to save it. If he had shot like a second earlier, he probably would have had a free goal. I get a good 50-50, it goes straight up, and I beat him to the ball. Get a pretty good shot on that. Wasn't really much else I could have done there, but just went straight back instead of going for the 50. Another neutral kickoff. I make a good touch around Pashi. Because I made that hit over him, I was able to get ball control from it. Helped me out quite a bit, actually. I'm just going to throw a shot on net and see if he does. I can play off this now that he's in an awkward spot. Alright, not the best hit. I wanted to roll up, but didn't roll up. And I shouldn't really have challenged that when I know he has me beat and he has a lot more boost than me. 
Yeah, two mistakes here. Two mistakes. Shouldn't have done both those things. Bad hit up the wall and then challenge something I should have just went straight back for. Alright, good job to beat him to the boost there and get control. He's gonna wait for whatever I want to do here. I see him turning and he comes a little bit too close to me and that's when I know I can flick it over him. As soon as I see him fake challenge and turn, I know I have definitely have enough clearance to get that ball over him and in the net. Alright, he messes up the shot a little bit there. Either he messed it up or he tried to fake. I think it was a backflip though by accident. Good shot, but it's a little bit off target. Kind of saved me a bit. Good hit from him with no boost to keep it in there. Another really good challenge to keep pressure up. So he's doing a good job here of just keeping constant pressure and stealing my boost. If you're watching me though, I'm just taking it really slow and waiting for him to give me ball. So as soon as I see him back off, that's what I'm going to go for. And that's exactly what I did. He still has boost control, but if I play it smarter than him, it'll be alright. So we tried to do a little bit of a fake aerial there. Messed up. I was able to get boost finally after waiting like a minute and I can eventually play it out and try to get a flick on target. He does pretty well to hit it to the side. I try to steal his boost. So he's just going to stay with this and I know that so I challenge him. Right here I'm just looking to see where he is and if he's going to come to me. I know I can beat him to it so I do. Now the ball bounces a little bit weird here. I should have just went back after that instead of going for that 50-50 but it works. At least he's not with the ball and I'm going to have a free possession play. Really, really good from him. So, I remember this when I was playing. I had no idea he was there at all. Like, I looked in front of me. I was just looking around for him. And I couldn't see him. And then, like, when I did end up seeing him, he was already way too close to my car for me to do anything. Just really good from him to catch me off guard like that. So, at this point, I just want to go to overtime. He has ball control, and I'm, I'm kind of trying to kill all the time here. Messed up my flick, but I went for a bump instead. And I came so close to getting that zero second goal, but just off target. I get a good kickoff here. He should have just hit this to the corner instead of going back, but he goes back instead and it leaves me with an empty net. I see it, and I hit it right in the bottom corner. That's the end of game two, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Like, comment, subscribe, and peace.